I had a businessman in my office one time, and I answered him by saying, here's what we feel. And he looked around and he said, but there's nobody else here but you. <laughs> and I laughed and I said, well, that's true to a point. I often answer this way, that we feel something or this is the way that we will proceed. There is a we in me and there's a we in you. The we in me is uh, uh, the negative self that is always looking at things in the wrong way, possibly, or the cautious way, or maybe it's the way that stands behind the wall of excuse. Then there's the present day me that is open to going either way. And then there is the other way, which is the overly optimistic self that often will thrust into doing things that really I shouldn't do, that I should hold back if I only could take the time to first go to God. Well, I've learned over time to take the time and first go to God. And there is a a, a bigger we, and that is God and I are one. And that when I go to God and when I become teachable with the three halves of my self or the three parts of myself, then, then I realize that there's a higher mind that can come through me and can come through you. In Psalms 32, verse 8, it says, I will instruct you and teach you the way you should go. I will counsel you with my eye upon you. Often we are fixated in human mind, going our way. And my golly, we're going to go our way no matter what. And that can be towards the negative side of ourselves or the super positive side that's thrusting ahead without uh, reason at all or, or guidance into an area that perhaps we shouldn't go. To become teachable as a human being is a big thing. There is always something new to learn in each day. And you join me in having a teachable part of yourself, a major part of yourself. You begin to ask God before you take any decision. You relax, you go in prayer, and you become teachable. You may begin the day with an anxious thought about some new responsibility that you have to do or about an important decision that you must make, but you let these thoughts be dissolved in the truth of who you are, not the negative side, not the overly optimistic side that goes forward without reason or even the present day moment side, but you realize that you're a child of God. You're connected and you are teachable. You know that you can do whatever you're called upon to do because you have that higher self than yourself that will come through, that will teach you and guide you. You are able to meet whatever you need to meet with the assurance that all of your activities are opportunities with your partner, God, and that you have the freedom to express the joy in your life, the joy of God, and you use your God-given talents and abilities that you may have now in your present day self or may be coming from on high. You know that God is teaching you everything that you need to know and that you're open to God's instruction. Whatever there is to be learned this day, you remain relaxed and teachable 
and poised and serene in the awareness of your all-knowing guide and teacher.